My dear viewers, Assalamu alaikum, may peace be upon you all. How are you today? Before we begin, let's take a moment to pray for our beloved brothers and sisters in Palestine. In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, O oh Allah, grant peace and justice to the people of Palestine. Protect them from oppression and grant them strength and resilience in the face of adversity. Shower your mercy upon them and bring an end to their suffering. Guide the hearts of leaders towards compassion and righteousness. And may the land of Palestine witness peace and prosperity once again. Amin. My dear viewers, Inshallah. Today we embark on a journey of learning Islamic Hadith in English. Focusing on the Hadith of Sahih al-Bukhari, we'll be exploring chapters 3, which delve into the Book of Revelation. My dear viewers, so, without further ado, let's dive right in and start this enlightening journey together. I seek Allah's protection from the rejected Satan, Devil, in the name of Allah, the Most Gracious, the Most Merciful. Chapter 3. Narrated Aisha, the mother of the faithful believers, the commencement of the divine inspiration to Allah's messenger peace be upon him was in the form of good dreams, which came true like bright daylight, and then the love of seclusion was bestowed upon him. He used to go in seclusion in the cave of Hira where he used to worship all alone, continuously for many days before, his desire to see his family. He used to take with him the journey, food for the stay and then come back to his wife Khadija, to take his food likewise again, till suddenly, the truth descended upon him, while he was in the cave of Hira. The angel came to him and asked him to read. The prophet peace be upon him replied, I do not know how to read. The prophet peace be upon him added, The angel caught me forcefully and pressed me so hard that I could not bear it any more. He then released me and again asked me to read, and I replied, I do not know how to read. Thereupon he caught me again and pressed me a second time, till I could not bear it any more. He then released me and again asked me to read. But again I replied, I do not know how to read, or what shall I read? Thereupon he caught me, for the third time and pressed me, and then released me and said, Read in the name of your Lord, who has created all that exists, created man from a clot, read, and your Lord is, the most generous. Surah number 96, verses number 1, 2, and 3, Al-Quran Kareem. Verses is <laughs> Al Quran Kareem, translation of Surah number 96, Surah Al Alak, Clot, verses number 1, 2, and 3 is verse number 1 is. Read, O Prophet, in the name of, your Lord, who created. Verse number, 2, created humans, from a clinging, clot. Verse number, 3, read, and your Lord, is the most generous. 